Are you a historian specialized in the Cold War or intelligence? Or a student of modern history? Then you probably know that many U.S. intelligence documents pertaining to these fields of study were recently declassified, most of them formerly top secret. This material is essential to gaining a better understanding of how secret intelligence operations informed and shaped U.S. and NATO defense and foreign policy making in regards to the Soviet Union during the Cold War. But how does one approach consulting these documents? With tens of thousands of pages spread across many libraries all over the U.S., how do you discover specific documents that are relevant to your research? Brill advisor Matthew Aid spent many years researching, selecting, and arranging all 21,700 pages of 2,360 declassified documents. The result of his work can now be accessed using Brill's online primary sources platform. This unique collection not only offers you complete records of the declassified documents, but also informs you of the successes and failures of the U.S. intelligence community and its foreign allies concerning their Cold War espionage activities. On the opening page, there are five tabs which will help you navigate the documents. By clicking on the background tab, you will find an introduction in which Matthew Age shares his extensive knowledge of this field, helping you to better understand the documents in their historical context. There are several ways to browse the collection. For example, by using the search tool on the home page. Enter a search term and you will see a chronological list of all documents containing your query. When clicking on a title, you will get the metadata of the document. Citations can easily be exported to EndNote and RefWorks. Click on Open Reader, and you will see a scan of the original document, including all original signatures and stamps. Your search query will be highlighted on the page for easy navigation. On the left side of the screen, you have the option of searching within a particular document. In the top right corner of the screen, you will find several options showing you how to use relevant documents outside the Brill Primary Sources online platform environment, such as the copy option, which allows you to select and copy the whole document, or only a part, to a clipboard for further use. This option uses OCR, or Optical Character Recognition, the quality of the copy will be equal to the scan of the original. Please visit brillonline.com for more information. Thank you for watching this Brill Online video demonstration.